guys, Susie here. Hey, John here, welcome back to the channel. And today we're gonna share with you tools that we love and use that help us save time, create content faster, and build our business better. This isn't just some throwing a bunch of tools at you. We're actually gonna break down the four categories that tend to take the most time when you're building your business, especially if you're in the summertime or just a busy phase of life. We wanna make sure you're efficient with your time. So we're gonna cover content creation. We're gonna cover graphic creation as well, keyword research, making sure you're working on the right things as well as improving your sales. And we'll give you both a premium tool and a free tool with each one of these categories. Definitely. Like. Um... I love this. We're both study to be industrial engineers, so we try to do things as efficient as possible. We, um, I've heard sometimes the best type of engineer is a lazy engineer because you try to find the most efficient way to do things because you're just so darn lazy and you procrastinate. And that's a little bit in all of us. <laughs> all right, so with that out of mind, let's not be lazy and let's dive into the content. <laughs> Susie, what is the first category? What's the first tool we're gonna talk about? The first tool we're gonna cover is called conversion.ai. And the, all the links to the tools are below. If you'd like to use them, there are our affiliate links and we really appreciate it. It doesn't cost you anything extra. Um, this tool helps you actually create content. So me personally, I love using it because I always get stuck writing blog posts. It takes me forever to write a blog post. Sometimes it can take me up to three or four days to finish a 2000 word blog post just because I'm just not moving forward. I don't have any ideas. I get stuck. And when I create my content with this tool, it helps me get over those little humps, right? You're writing a sentence. You're like, oh, that's great. And then you're like, I lost my train of thought. That's what this tool comes in and it helps you generate ideas. So you can just click a little button and it starts creating content for you. It can't create the entire blog post. It's not that smart, but it's kind of like you're working together as a team. I write a sentence and it writes a sentence and I write two sentences and it writes one. So <laughs> we're kind of like me and conversion.ai or we're buddies and we help each other create content. I like to think of it as your mini me or your assistant in the writing process. So Susie really touched on the blogging. It helps you come up with blog topic ideas, blog post introduction paragraphs, feature to benefits, and the entire blog post outline. So it's not really meant to be a search engine optimization tool. It's not gonna tell you the perfect headlines, but it's gonna give you that flow. It's gonna give you that cohesive structure to help you dive in as well. The other thing I like for this is not for blogging, but also for writing your sales pages, mm -hmm. writing your personal biographies, your, your bios and your, your links and whatnot, as well as any other content that needs to go in. So for example, um, I do a lot of funnel creation, sales page writing, things like that. So having the ability to do AIDA, you know, attention, interest, desire, and action uh, frameworks to sell more products, this has all these programmed in. It's really cool. And um, also the creative stories is really fun. If you're bored, <laughs> make some creative stories there. You'll laugh. It's All very right. fun. So I would suggest that if you get stuck on writing content and you're just not flowing, this is a great tool for that. Also, if you already potentially have a team of writers or if you have somebody who creates content for you, you can have them use this tool as well and generate content faster. So it's great for your VA or your writer or whatnot as well. Yeah, so I'm kind of browsing through the page here. If we look at the pricing page, uh, you can get started for 30 bucks a month. Uh, which is totally reasonable. Uh, we are on the unlimited plan. It's great. If you wanted this to be your writing buddy, and like we kind of talked about, you're going to go over those 20,000 words over the course of a month, but you can get started for only $29, which is great. But I would say this is a bit in a bit more the premium tool category. So a alternative, which is a little bit more affordable, uh, not the exact same category of tool. Okay. Like this is all in the umbrella of creating content. Yeah. So the other aspect of creating content is making sure your content is, is set up and structured properly. So doing a lot of research on your competitors and doing some analysis, making sure your headers are optimized. Phrase, F-R-A-S-E dot I-O is a solid tool for this. It has a free plan as well, um, which allows you to essentially uh, understand if your topic is on point from an SEO perspective. It helps you see what statistics are being used out there in the internet and make sure that yours is uh, the right word length, the right keyword difficulty, and all that stuff baked into your article as you're writing it. Yeah, so it's a different type of assistant, making sure your whole outline and your blog post is structured correctly, um, where conversion AI is more of like, I write with you, I'm your writing buddy. But both great tools. If you want to, you can use both of them, like we kind of do, and then use the power of both to create amazing content. 
yeah, we found is being able to do your research inside a phrase and kind of see what you want to target. And then as you're writing, if you hit a roadblock, bounce over to conversion AI, he's going to get you unstuck real quick. And then you're going to go right back to, uh, to phrase to finish the article off. We've cut our writing time down from about two to three hours for a pillar post down to about 30 to 45 minutes. It's pretty cool. All yeah, right. I went from a couple of days to like an hour. So you're you're faster writer than I am. So what's the next category, Susie? All right, what is our next category? And this went blank. The next category is graphics <laughs> creation. So <laughs> obviously, just having great content doesn't work if you can't get the click. So you want to make sure your graphics are clickable, whether you're doing Pinterest marketing or Facebook or just simply putting a featured image on your blog post. You want it to look good, right? Be on brand, all that great stuff. So we have two tools for you in this category. The first one is called Glorify. And Glorify is one that I've been using since the inception. <laughs> Super sorry. Let me make sure I'm sharing my screen here. There is Glorify. <laughs> And Glorify is really awesome because it allows you to take a picture with your phone, upload that picture straight here. If you, if you have anything with physical stuff, like if you're teaching you know, kids activities and you want to be able to show the actual toy that you're using to teach something or a manipulative or anything like that, you can take a picture with your phone and you can see here on the screen is actually removing the background yeah, of that cool. without doing any Photoshop magic or like going line by line or pixel by pixel. It's miserable. So that's great. And then it also has a ton of uh, social media or templates for social media, for blogging, for advertising, anything like that. All right. And pricing on this one is, oh, they, they do have a free plan. That's pretty cool. Pretty but cool. they're limited down to how many background removals, which is really like one of the key features and um, other things like that. So uh, great tool. Use it for a long time. It's been very, very solid. Do you, what, what do you think about Glorify? I like it. I like the background removal. It's pretty cool for like, I like the example that you have for physical products or kids activities. I personally use Canva, All right? So Canva is my go-to. I do my Pinterest images on there. I do my social media images on there and my hero mock-up images to kind of sell my products and our courses and our freebies. We do all our mock-ups in Canva as well. So if you guys don't know what mock-ups are or hero images, they help you convert your sales pages higher and showcase your products, especially if they're digital products like courses and eBooks and whatnot. Um, we do have a link below so you can check out the mock-ups that we personally use and if you want to use them as well. But Canva, Glorify, they're both great um, graphic design tools that either one is going to work for you. Absolutely. So the next category here is on creating good content and you don't want to just pull up a blank page and start writing whatever comes to your heart. It's going to make you feel good, but it's going to make you very sad when you look at your statistics 30, <laughs> 40, 60 days later, right? Because blogging in 2021 is not about journaling. It's not about uh, expressing your feelings. That's great as a hobby. I'm not telling you not to do that. But if you want to build a business, you want to make sure you have solid keyword research at your back. And what keyword research basically is, in a nutshell, is it's telling you what people care about, what people are searching for, what problems people are trying to solve. And it's telling you what words you can uh, you know, create content around or what themes you can create content around to get your content discovered and consumed, right? So... Uh, I personally use and love AREFs. Um, it's a bit of a pricey tool, but once you get into that content creation and you're going after keywords, it's so valuable. If you think about, okay, what if you tackle the wrong keyword and you spend hours and weeks on creating content around the wrong keywords, that's just going to be such a waste. So sign up for AREFs, use it for a month or two, then grab all the keywords you can out of it and then build your content calendar. So that's a little tip that you can do so you don't have to pay for it every month. We do, we really like the tool. I do a lot of keyword research, but if you're more frugal, you can sign up for a month or use a free trial and get a lot of keywords out of it. So what I suggest you would do is go into AREFs, look at your competitors, see what they're ranking for, see if you could actually rank for those keywords. If the um, keyword difficulty is too high, hey, maybe put that on the back burner when your blog's a little stronger, you have more backlinks, then you can tackle those. But this allows you to see which keywords you could go after, what's their difficulty, what your competitors are ranking for, what people are searching for, the the search volume. It's a really phenomenally strong and robust tool. Yeah, so if you're listening in and you're not a keyword research <laughs> expert, you're like, what the heck did she just say? So one really thing <laughs> I, I will also let you know, 
when you sign up, I think it's even available for free without being a paying member. Um, they have a course on how to use the tool and a course on how to actually do keyword research the way that this tool was designed to facilitate, okay? So if everything Susie just said, she's been doing this for years. So I don't know half the stuff she just said. because <laughs> like research. SEO is not really my jam. I just throw keywords at John and he writes them really, really well. Yeah. <laughs> That's a nice, healthy relationship We're there. Good team. <laughs> All right. So that is the premium option. But again, like we said, we have a premium and a freemium option for each one. So the lower tiered option is called Keywords Everywhere. Unfortunately, this used to be a free tool a while back, and then they kind of made to where you have to pay a little bit, but it's so So affordable. little. They only, like, I paid $10, I think, a year ago, and I can still use it. Yeah. They only did that. Um, so you pay a small amount so that bots don't crawl it. So it's still technically free. It's it's $10 and you can probably use it for the whole year. Technically free. Technically, yeah. It does say here, the credits do expire after one year. Oh, so Lordy, I did you... not know that. <laughs> Backing up facts. All right. Thank you. So what Keywords Everywhere essentially is, is when you go and you search for something in Google, you're going to have a little bar off to the side, a little widget on the sidebar that will show you the overall competitive ranking, how many searches go for that word, and general difficulty and a yeah. few other things, right? Yeah, so kind of if you have a feel for keywords, then this is a great tool just kind of use um, if you have already some knowledge on SEO. Um, but if you don't, then I would suggest getting something more robust like AREFs kind of get grounded in what SEO is and then use keywords everywhere just kind of as your buddy as you go along with it. Still a great, really great tool. We're all about buddies here, right? Yeah, I just want more buddies. So <laughs> be our buddy. Subscribe to the channel with that as a little segue there. <laughs> so the fourth and final category we want to cover today is on promotions and selling your products, right? Yes. If we don't have a lot of time, Keywords and all this stuff are great, but ultimately we do want to make sales and we do want to bring in an income to support our family. Gotta pay for all those toys back there. All those Pokemons. <laughs> oh, look at those guys. Hello. All right, so the first category, the first tool in this category that is a bit of a premium tool we love and use every single day is Thrivecart. That's how we sell pretty much anything that you can pay for from us is with Thrivecart. It's really powerful. It allows you to take a customer who would normally just buy Oh, $20 product and turn them into somebody who can buy a $100, $200 uh, total cart value by offering upsells and downsells, all the kind of funnel stuff that sometimes if you experience somebody who creates a bad funnel, you can be like, well, who is this guy and why are they selling? Like, you can abuse these powers, but these powers can be used for good. And that's kind of what we teach and what we hope we are doing for you as well is um, allowing people to get what they need and create that customer journey for them so they know what the next step is in the process. So Thrivecart's great for giving coupons, for running promotions, and uh, just converting higher with every product that you sell. Yeah, and the thing that's fantastic about Thrivecart is it's a one-time fee. Yeah. So it's a one-time investment. It's not monthly at three or $400 a month that you yeah. have to pay for a funnel software. It's one time, and you get it, and you can implement it. And it took us a while to to be comfortable to implement it, to take, I mean, it's a big commitment to do that investment, but once we did, our daily sales like almost doubled. So it was completely worth it to go through the effort of changing over and use Thrivecart. It completely, like having that funnel implemented was such a big game changer for our business. And it allowed us to focus again on traffic and building our brand and knowing that the funnel is set up and it's doing the sales for us. So it's like this automatic kind of sales force that's helping us instead of us trying to run promotions, running yep. sales, following up on everybody. It was a phenomenal investment for us. And great word she used of calling it a sales force because one of the features that I want to make sure we really harp on because not a lot of people have tons of traffic at their disposal, right? But we all have friends. So one of the features that is fantastic inside Thrivecart is they have a built-in affiliate center where if you know somebody who is an influencer in your space or at least somebody who's a few steps ahead of you, chances are they want to make more money too. Chances are you need to get traffic to your offers. So you can turn them into affiliates where they are your sales force, and they can send traffic to your products. And if they convert, Thrivecart does a great job of tracking all this and automatically paying out your affiliates what they're due. You can set the commission structure, all that stuff. And you can have them sign up with a couple of clicks. So Very that simple. is fantastic because you got two things working for you here. You got number one, it's a lifetime deal where you pay once and you make that investment in your business and you're good. And then step two is you have something that can help you with where you're at, if, especially if you're in a beginning state where it's not overly complicated to set up 
and it's got the ability for you to tap into traffic sources from others to build your brand and your sales. It's so a really good affiliate program. We, we like that one a lot. Yeah. Number two, again, because it is a bit of a premium tool that might not be in everyone's budget, we have, um, this is one that we've stopped using and we, we recommend it, but not that much, uh, but it's called Sendow. And um, it can do something similar where it can sell your digital products. Um, talk a little bit about Sendow, Susie. So I used it way in the beginning, probably like five years ago to sell my first digital ebook, right? Or just ebook. Um, it worked really well, but once I started making about $500, and I could upgrade, I upgraded to a different software that was more robust. So Sundial is great to start with. It's great to kind of get your feet wet and start selling your first couple digital products with that. But once you're ready, you can upgrade to something more uh, capable of helping your business grow. Yeah, so looking at the pricing table here, you could get started for only $9 per month, which pay attention, there, there's, a, there's a lesson here. Uh, so you can get started for $9 a month and be able to sell some products. And that's great. A lot of you would flock right to that. But I will also give you the warning here that what happens a lot of time is when you take the short term choice, of like, okay, let me get just get going with here. When you get that momentum and you're ready to upgrade, you're going to kill your momentum because you've had all these systems created on this one process, knowing the limitations that you'll have to outgrow them. And then you'll have to redo it all and go to a better platform. So, um, do what's right for you. Obviously, if one is not in your budget, start with wherever your budget's at, but understand that when you get successful with that, there will be a bit of a changeover yep. experience that can be, oh, so fun. I helped so many clients go over that changeover, and it's great. <laughs> yeah, but I love that in this video, we're recommending both premium and more affordable solutions so you can find the right thing that works for you. For sure. All right, guys, so I hope that was helpful. I hope you're having a fantastic day, a fantastic summer. If you want to check out any of the tools that are here, there are links down below. Once again, if you think this content is helpful, if you like the little banter between husband and wife trying to help you guys grow your businesses online, uh, be sure to subscribe, like the video, leave a comment. All yeah. the good stuff. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Take care.